is Huey Lewis and I've closed Huey and I in the bathroom right now so we can just have a little one-on-one -on -one time to share this video with you. Um, Huey has had a tough life. He's probably about eight years old. He's front declawed. Declawing um, and adding that into rescue situations and you get cats that are a little suspicious and sometimes uh, defensive and nervous and they have no claws left so they do nip and Huey does nip. Um, Huey went to a home. That home didn't work out. He was there for a year and then he came back uh, and he was, we have to admit because we're honest in this program, he was peeing inappropriately um, on that owner's uh, belongings. Um, he has been perfect here. We have run full blood, thyroid, urinalysis, we've done a dental, um, we've taken him to the vet and checked out uh, to make sure that there were no uh, medical reasons and so he's completely vetted and ready to go. And uh, litter box issues, we know that nobody wants litter box issues, we understand that. Um, so we are willing to do a trial adoption with Huey. That means somebody takes him um, and promises to give him a 30-day trial and see how he does. And then if it works, uh, he has an adoption scholarship and he stays there. If it doesn't work, he comes back. There's no hard feelings or black marks on your, your record or anything like that. Um, but all of that having been said, litter box issues are 99% of the time solvable. They really are. You have to do certain things. Uh, cats, when they have litter box issues, they're making statements that something is not right or they're not happy about certain things. And so some of the things for Huey, um, for example, would be a low stress household, uh, some love and attention and compassion, but letting him approach uh, somebody on his own speed. Um, Huey, this is really a, not a great picture here of your backside. Hey, Huey, how about talking to us face to face? Well, of course, he's in the bathroom where he's exploring areas that he hasn't seen before. So, but there he is. Um, anyway, uh, you know, two litter boxes, a low stress household, um, no pellets in the litter. When you have a declawed cat, you don't want to use pellets, it hurts their feet. So there's lots of things to do to solve the litter box issues or to make sure that they don't happen. And we will work very closely with whoever is, um, you know, interested in giving this guy a chance. Uh, so what are the good, good things about Huey and why would somebody, you know, want to take this guy on? Well, you know, he really is a nice cat and he's, he's, this is rescue. We're looking for people who want to do something for the cat. They want to help a cat that's maybe got a little bit more, uh, or a little bit less likelihood of being a really adoptable cat for various reasons. They want to do something for the under cat, so to speak. And Huey's one of those, and he's not what I would term a project cat. That, you know, project cats we use for the for the really involved and the really difficult cats that we think, wow, these cats are just never going to be successful, and boy, is it going to be difficult for them to be successful. Huey can be successful. There's no question. Um, he's a nice, curmudgeon old guy. Uh, not old, even old. We think he's about eight, and blood values and everything is strong. So certainly he can be successful, I think. I think he needs to like his person. His person needs to like him. That's key with Siamese. Um, I think he needs to be allowed to come to them on his own terms, uh, not be forced into interacting. And he will interact, um, but you know, he's not going to be the cat that you go over and pick up and grab and all that kind of stuff. And I think he needs to be um, some, you know, someone who likes Siamese, they want to talk to him, they want to have conversations with him, they want to ask him how his day went and what's going on in his mind. They want to include him and make him feel, you know, loved and an important part of their family. And I think that's very key. Um, with cats like Huey, when they don't feel that, when they feel somebody doesn't like them, is annoyed with them, doesn't care about them, doesn't have time for them, then you, <coughs> you do get some issues. <coughs> Excuse me. So that's Huey's story. Huey. <coughs> and we hope somebody will, will see it in their heart to give him a chance.